Something a lot of people talk about is JSDoc versus TypeScript. Now, JSDoc is basically just comments inside code inside your JavaScript files. This is a JavaScript file here where we're annotating A and B with a number. And you look here and it's actually a fair amount of code for what you can do in TypeScript with literally just a couple of annotations here, A number, B number. Again, this is the TypeScript version. This is the JavaScript version. And you think, okay, JSDoc is great because I don't need a build step. I don't need to turn my files into JavaScript files. They're just JavaScript files already. And in TypeScript, you do definitely need a build step in order to make that work. But actually, in order to get this strong typing here that we're seeing inside JS doc, you notice we're getting a warning when we're passing in the wrong thing here. You actually do need a tsconfig.json and you need to run the TypeScript compiler on this. So actually, both of these things over here also belong in JS doc land. So JS doc is really just like TypeScript with a little bit worse annotations.